my beautiful and amazing family how are you all doing thank you very much for always supporting me i really do appreciate if to those the first time you are coming across this channel this is agatha progress channel on youtube and i come across your way every blessed day as you can see in this channel we react to all videos and in this channel all opinion is highly needed in the comment section and if you love what i am doing in this channel why don't you click on that button that says subscribe and turn on the bell icon so that we become one big family all right my wonderful family this video we're about to watch i don't know how you felt about this video but i do hope you got some lesson from it all right my wonderful people let's go straight into the video now watch it they're here to expose them those chiefs those chiefs they need to be going down one by one they need to be going down by one by one because they are the part of the problem those ones that call themselves elders they are the part of the uh, uh, part of the problem today the 25th of june 2021 information reaching us by mazi Igwe chukuma today that the Fulani has just arrived at Ataroga community in our do local government area, Benue State, a Biafran part that was given to the, to the, to the Benue people that has a common boundary with the Boni State. And uh, when we do more investigation, we now find out that the chiefs from that community have already gotten the information that they are coming. Since about 5 a.m. today. You know saying now? And the only way that he thinks that he can be able to safeguard his people is by asking the community to leave their land, leave their houses, and run away. Remember what happened on the 30th, on the 30th of May. On the 30th of May, on Sunday. Remember what happened. Over 200 uh, 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 Biafras were massacred, were massacred in a Boni state. And before that incident still took place, Mazibwe Chukuma went to the, to the Royal Highness, we don't know his name yet, he went to him and asked him and said to him, provide security for your people because these people are coming. He didn't do anything. He did not do anything. That is why over 200 people were massacred. Mazibwe Chukuma, Igwe, Mazibwe Chukuma. He personally took the photo, the camera, and he was speaking to the people when he was there. He was there speaking to the people. He was in the circle of the dead bodies. He was speaking to the people and asked, Any who, how many of you remember the day I came and I was speaking to the Royal Highness and his chief, uh, chief, chief, uh, 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 chief uh, uh, whatever they call them. A lot of them said, yes, we are aware of that. Today again, today again, today again, if this report had not gotten out, things would have gotten out of hand. Just say now. Now, today again, in in a in a other uh, 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 Ataroga community, in our don local government area, Benue State, that has a common boundary with the Boni State, Fulani arrived, and the information came in. The chief asked the community that they should run and leave their land, leave their houses. We are making sure, we are doing everything humanly possible to make sure that the lawful and will be able to stay in our land. We are making sure we send them packing, let them go to the north. But chiefs are busy bringing them in. This is a confirmation. And the previous video that we made, a live broker that we made, on so many platforms, quick, they just shut them down. We have to start another one right now. We called him one of the witness. He was there on the ground, and he told us... Hold on. Mazi Gochukuma. Sir? We are back to life again. We are back to life again. We are back... I'm trying to bring people to, the, to update to tell them what is going on before I call uh, 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 Mazunwa to give us the name okay. of those uh, chiefs but you can also uh, speak I'm just speaking about 
the incident that happened on the 30th, which you yourself, you personally took the video of those dead bodies, and you told, you stand in the, in the middle of those dead bodies, asking people how many of them were aware the day you came speaking to the royal high. Can you please tell to tell, tell the world again the encounter or discussion you have with them, the Royal Highness and his chief dances? Thank you. Thank you. Do I need to mention my name again? No, you don't need to. Okay. I went to the chief, and the chief is with their cabinet and the other people around that place. I told the chief that he should form a security around that place. That what is going to happen when it happens, everybody, including him, being the chief, we run away and we don't know where the family is. They thought that I'm joking and I warned them seriously that something is going to happen and when those things happen, all of them will run away. They will not know where their family is. They thought that uh, maybe uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very talk. So later, on 30th May 2021, Rouhani attacked the same community and killed about 100 people. So, I went there myself. When I took the video, I went there and asked the community how many of them were there when I was talking to the chief and uh, his cabinet. Many of them raised up their hand. And I asked them, is there anything that relates to what what I told Chief that happened today, they say yes. I say, what is it? I say, this is the, 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 the evidence to prove what I told Chief. I told them that it's okay, but I want to let them know that this government we are now, it was our people that are killing us. Because they listen to what we have been saying. All this is, even though it happens, we must retaliate. But to look at it today, that Biafra is the only hope. The Biafra is the only hope. In their presence there, oh, they gather me, they, they, even as I'm talking to them, all of a sudden, everybody run away. And leave me alone together with that, that dead body there. Stand there alone with the dead body. Before I call them back, I said they should come back. What makes them run? Without knowing that somebody is with the gun around that place. But they take not a planning and that is the reason why all of them run away and if to say that people that we are planning they would have killed me there at the middle of that dead body so since that time till now nothing is done but look at the since the second one the second massacre from the planning in our place and that is why we are crying for help now we need the help we need the help around that place. That place needs to be secured. Today they have come back again, just to kill us. That is why, as I'm talking to you, my heart is full of tears. I'm crying because I know what my people are passing through there. All those chiefs and the councillors, they don't want to do anything. They, want, uh, they went and gathered village. Village. Villagers that don't even have one night to, to feed themselves. Started sharing money for them to, to, to buy buy weapons. Meanwhile, some prominent men, all of them, they were there. Those people that are collecting money from... Uh, from uh, hey, now that you've heard it all from the horse's mouth, what do you think about this video? Please do well to drop your opinion for me in the comment section because a lot of things has been going on. But some people form deaf ears as if nothing is happening. But we we know what is going on and we know a lot has been going on. Alright, my wonderful family. Thank you very much for always supporting me on this very movement. If you know you haven't subscribed, please do where to subscribe and join the family. So that whenever I upload a new video, you will be here and we watch it together. Thank you.